Hi guys, it's Paul again from my YouTube art tutorial channel. Um, today, uh, tutorial, uh, we're gonna had a couple of requests in. Uh, a good friend of mine's uh, son, uh, who we look after uh, and uh, spend a lot of time with. Um, James uh, loves dinosaurs, so I thought I'd do uh, a very quick uh, dinosaur for James to have a go at, uh, and other people that like dinosaurs. Um, so this is a really simple dinosaur using the letter K. So I'm going to do it above the shark that I did a few weeks ago uh, using the, uh, the number 4. Um, so this is the letter K um, dinosaur. So I'm going to do it here if you can see it. Hopefully you can see this. Uh, it won't go really very much above the top of the letter K. Um, so we'll do this quite small so it's quite quick to do. You guys can do it as... Um, as uh, big as you want, okay. Um, so there's the letter K. So if you could draw that, that's great. Uh, I'll do this step by step for you, so you can follow and and do it uh, with me. So there's one eye, okay. Now we want half an eye peeking out there, okay. Then we've got two little nostrils of the dinosaur, two dots there and there, okay. Um, now, what we want to do is, from the top of the K, you want to just bring in a line to um, the eye there, okay? And then another one, uh, which is going to go down here, okay, to there, all right? Um, we'll just do three little lines there, a couple of lines up there, a couple of lines up there. Now, from the nostril... Um, you want to do a little triangle, uh, or a little line like that, and then a line across, okay? And then we're going to do four lines like that, okay? Now, underneath his eye, okay, we're going to do a little squiggle like that, okay? Everybody with me? Hopefully you've done that. Um, now, we want circle now which is almost a full circle like that okay and what you want to do is put some spikes on it but not make them too sharp okay so kind of curves you could do sharp ones if you really wanted to okay so this is almost looking like a triceratops if you know anything about dinosaurs you know, I was into dinosaurs when I was young um, so this is a obviously a cartoon version. Uh, now we want the teeth, so we're going to match those uh, these sharp edges like that. Okay, nice and easy. Now the body uh, from about here, you want to go down to about there. Okay, and then we go across and up, and then we want most like a square letter U, um, like that, okay. Um, now, curve there. Now the tail, you could do as long as you wanted to. Okay, I'm gonna do a tail like this. There you go. Um, now, from here, okay, you're going to have one curve like this, all right, and then, we're going to have another line down here like this. Okay, so that's what our bottom of our head's going to look like. All right, um, so that's that's pretty much um, your dinosaur. We just want one other small foot in there. Okay, so just just in front of this one, just a little, just so you can see the um, the leg behind. Okay. Uh, and then we're just going to colour it in. So I'm going to do kind of a, an orangey colour. Okay. Um, I'm going to do a little orangey, yellowy orange colour. You could do whatever colour you like. Green, purple, um, all sorts of uh, colours you can do for your dance. So it doesn't matter. It's not an actual uh, triceratops, so it doesn't really matter what colour you do. Um, so I'm going to do... A little bit of shading here, see if you can colour this in. Um, you're trying to avoid the um, the 
teeth and the, the scales, if you like, the spikes, if you can. Avoid those because you're going to do those grey. Um, or you could use a pencil if you wanted to with those, just to make them uh, stand out from the, your colouring. Okay, so I'm using pencil crayon. You could use a felt if you wanted to. I would say probably if you're quite young, let's say you're under, I don't know, five or six, um, you'd probably do this a lot larger. Maybe even ask somebody to draw it out for you to colour it in to start off with, just to get your shading um, better. Um, so practice your shading. Um, I used to ask my dad to draw me things to colour in when I was really young. Just keep practicing, that's all you need to do. Just keep having a go. Okay, so I'll try and get my hand out of the way in a minute. Um, just doing this quite quick. So I'm not taking a great deal of time shading in. Okay, um, the tail again, you could do it as a really long tail, a curved tail, a short stubby tail, whatever you wanted to really. Um, but that's my kind of nod to dinosaurs there. Um, what I'm going to do is just use a little bit of light grey now, um, just through this area. So we've got a horn here, and another horn there, okay, and we're just going to simply colour these in ever so light. Don't want them too dark. Okay, so just a splash of colour in each of these spikes, okay. Don't worry at this stage if you've done them over the top of, uh, I'm going to leave those white actually, um, white eyes, okay. Uh, now with the feet I'd go to a uh, fine liner now, if you've got a fine liner that would be great, um, a really thin um, pen if you can, a black one. Um, what you want to do is go over everything um, if you can. Okay, so dot in there, dot for the eye, curve there. Again, you might want to get, if you're really young, get somebody else to do this for you. Mum or dad or something like that. Okay, nice and light here. Keep the white teeth, if you can. Curve there. We'll go in. One, two, three, one, two. Get this curve going on here. Okay, round each of these. Don't have to finish them all off. You don't have to touch the, the body with them all if you don't want to. Okay, that's what we're doing, that kind of thing. You might need to get somebody to help you do this, if you, as I say, if you're really young. Okay, um, we're going to go up and around here. This is what we're doing. Perfect. Curve like that. Okay, now on the tail, just do a couple of dots. You want, if you can, a few small things for the, the feet the toes, like that, okay, uh, and then just the lines, one, two, three, four, dot for the nose, nostrils, curve like that, and we are done. There is our little dinosaur using the letter K. Um, so hopefully you can have a go at that. Um, have a good day, speak to you soon.